1952, I went to life and I suggested that they let me do an essay on football. And I had never been to a football game before. This was college football. So I spent a season. Every Saturday, I would go to a different game, different parts of the country. And I did this essay, which life ran. This was a double truck picture. It was taken with a large camera. I focused on the referee. And then when everybody started running, uh, you know, you got that effect. Yeah. That essay ran and caused quite a bit of comment. It was very attractive. It ran in 53, and that was the year that Sports Illustrated started. And the guy in charge of the uh, photography, he was fascinated with this essay. And he called me up and he said, you know, he said, first of all, I want you to work for us. And I said, well, you know, I never photographed any sports <laughs> except this for this football thing. He said, that doesn't matter. So that, that football take actually got me started on sports photography. This cover in November uh, 1954, it's a typical Jerry Cook photograph. He would uh, wander around behind the scenes uh, looking for something that uh, nobody else was focusing on. And uh, in this shot, he captured the, a sense of the crowd at a football game. Uh, he could do the kind of thing that gave you an intimate look at the background of sports. He preferred to wander among the crowds uh, go behind the scenes and get vignettes. In that sense, he was the, the old school photojournalist. 